Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, it is not your birthday. Uh, just finished the Aquarius reading. Uh, it was my birthday uh, a day ago. So I'm gonna take this out. So let's get into it, Pisces. Thank you, God, for blessing Pisces with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Pisces, let's see what's going on for you in love. So we got the Hermit card, all right? And the Seven of Cups in reverse. Hmm. Okay, so um, someone could be thinking about what to do, and they're, they're taking a lot of time by themselves. Somebody's not serious here. Okay, or they don't know what to choose. Could be you, could be the other person. The Hermit card upright, it talks about maybe needing to go venture off by yourself, self-discovery, maybe even a change of personality or personal preference or philosophy, like you're changing what you think about. You fill in the blank, this is about love, so this would be about maybe a love relationship. You're not sure. Um, you, you, this could be same sex also for some of you. Um, somebody's coming out of conf conf uh, conflict or confusion about what it is they really want. Maybe even coming out of stagnancy, procrastination, only to go into seclusion or to be a, rec a recluse. And then maybe even come back out of that to go in a new direction. This is interesting. So it's like, maybe somebody's gonna make up their mind. Are we staying together? Is this really real? Something about something not being real. Maybe a relationship isn't real because there's a lot of time spent apart or there's a lot of energy where somebody operates as a single person. They don't make plans for the whole, for the connection, for the relationship. They make plans for themselves. They act very single. Someone, it's just like, this could even be given up. Someone doesn't believe the, maybe the sweet nothings. Someone doesn't believe the promises anymore. And somebody is not even making them anymore. Somebody is really focused on going in a different direction. Somebody could also be going to get advice about needing guidance, seeking something here because they are without something within a relationship. Let's see what career and finance has to offer you. Okay, very nice. So you're coming to a level of expertise in your field. You you are the go-to person. You have all the knowledge, all the um, wherewithal. You, you may even be incorporating something new into your business, if this is a business, or you may be going up for a new job. Um, some of you are thinking about the future in terms of your, a lot of business coming up here. Maybe even thinking about the level of consistency that you do something, you might even want to scale back. Also learning something else or even bringing on another element of something here. You're thinking about how to think outside of the box in terms of you, your business, your brand. It says that um, you built an empire from nothing. And you had to be strong. You took a lot. You had to maintain. Even in the face of adversity. With the page of pentacles, it says it's of course it's good news in terms of business mat money matters so if there's a money matter that you're you're waiting to hear back on or get news of or an approval or moving forward it's good news especially if there is deliberation or there is maybe negotiation here you could receive a, a verbal offer that sounds good and you just have to okay it or someone else has to okay it you could now have a staff or you could have a, this is like a, an apprentice, a personal assistant. You're making plans for your, your financial future and what it looks like. Some of you have to make a large payout, but it's going to be over time. 
Yeah, some of you have to make a large payout and it's going to be over time. Some of you are getting in right, like you're trying to get in front of something. So maybe you're trying to file your paperwork first or you're trying to make something happen first. First is coming up. You're praying for something to be reversed, maybe a, a judgment, a settlement. This could have something to do with court. You have a lot of money to pay, maybe in restitution of, 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 for something. You, you're traveling back and forth. Whatever it is, uh, Pisces, it looks like your money is good, it's solidified, it's solid, but at the same time, um, you still have some payments and some judgments and some some ways that you you need to kind of uh, regroup, uh, maybe incorporate something else. It looks like your money will be solid maybe for a lifetime or forever. We've got the unk showing up in his hand, eternal. Or you're trying to bring in, it looks like a high level of, of achievement here, especially in career and finance. Like you have an, a real legacy empire. You'll have something to give to the next generation when you're gone uh, from this place. Yeah. Um, either you're trying to get to that place or you're trying to, or you're already there. Some of you have turned your back on options. Options that break, that have no value, that was just fun or fun in the sun. You don't want it anymore. Some of you want something better or you want something different. Or you want something real. Something about change of philosophy or personal, personal, um, your personality. So this is what I have for you, Pisces. Um, if it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. It looks like you're going to embark on something big, bring something new in. You're waiting for judgments to be either reversed or made here. Um, you're coming up with new ideas in terms of your business, waiting for packages. You're just really in a place of movement and fast movement, trying to do something fast and first. So this is what I have for you, Pisces. If it resonates, again, let me know. Uh, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.